the next 20, 20, 25 years, say by around 2035, 25% of the world's working population will be Indian. 25% of the world's working population will be Indian because India is a young country. We are a very ancient country, but a very young nation. Young, as an identity, we are only about 64, 67, 68 years old. But most importantly, in terms of the composition of the population, most of our people are below 35. And those 35 and so people will continue to contribute to the world for the next 30 years without any problems. And that is a humongous opportunity for us as a country and you as an individual to tap. I didn't know what was going to happen. Of course, I must admit that I was in a better position than most of the students uh, who joined with us because I had already completed my CA and I had actually acquired a one year work experience in the industry. So it wasn't completely Greek and Latin for me. But even then, there were a lot of misgivings on what's going to happen, how things will be, etc. etc. Now, over the next two years, what I really learned was that management is not a set of books. Management is not a set of you know transportation problems and uh, algorithms and uh, formulae. Right? But management is an art, it's not a science. How you practice management is far more important than what you actually learn in the classroom. What you learn in the classroom is important. It gives you the techniques. But personally, what I learned outside of the classroom was probably 20 times more valuable. <coughs> Sun rises in the east. Right? You ask a five-year-old child, he says, Kaas is anutta, it is east. You stand in Norway. The sun will be on your southeast. You go to Antarctica, sun will be on your northwest. Sorry, northeast and southeast. Sorry. Now, is it really east? Is it myth? Is it a falsehood that the sun rises in the east? Or is it also a falsehood that in Norway the sun is in the southeast? Which is truth? So, truth is from a reference point. If you stand in Singapore, which is on the equator, and you look up, the sun will be directly on you in the east. You go to the right, it will be to your northeast. You go to the left, it will be to your southeast. So truth is not truth. Truth is the way you see it. it is, he gave me the greatest gift of life. He said, remember, every time you fall flat on your face, Right? Remember every time you fall flat on your say on your face, remember that you are moving six feet forward. Isn't that progress? So don't be scared of falling flat on your face. Fall every time, 20 times, 30 times. If you did that, you move 200 meters forward, 200 feet forward. Otherwise, you would be there, like a stone, petrified. So if you want to make progress, take risk, fail and learn from that failure and go forward. Committing a mistake once is a mistake. Repeating the mistake is a crime. 